So this is going to be a video tutorial on how to make a Pirelli or Ropalta. It will look something like this when you're done. And then you can also apply the same design and make um, bridles and other things. I'm not really sure what else. And this is kind of like a Pirelli or a rope halter. You can call it either one. And I tried to make my own design, but I mean, there's really not much different design you can go. So I'm sorry if you made one and it looks like exactly like this and you'd be like, hey, you copied off of my idea. I didn't copy off of anybody, okay? Okay, so um, first off, what you'll need is you'll need a model horse, briar or whatever. You'll need scissors. You'll need um, yarn. I'm using baby yarn, be just simply because it's thinner and it's a little softer, but really that doesn't matter. Okay, and then what's optional is glue. So you don't have to use glue, but you can. Okay, so let me just set up my camera. Okay, so first what you're going to do is you're going to take your yarn. Can you see that? Yeah. And you're just going to tie it around the horse's nose. And then you're going to cut it really long. Got my scissors. Just because... um how I do the bottom knot is I take it around and then I pull it through you know and then you can just like adjust with the horse adjust the nose size with the horse you know like that so it's tight and it stays on and it can still like slide up and down and then what you're going to do um, you can either measure, uh, each, like, side, and then, of course, you'd cut it there and measure the same length, or actually, you'd cut it a little longer, so, like, up to the ear, from there to there, if you're going to tie it. You could also glue it, and if you're gluing, um, the yarn should come, like, underneath the horse's eye. Or like, you know, at the edge. Okay. So, another way, which is you can almost eliminate a step, is you can just take this and bring it from this side all the way around to this side. And then if you wanted from here, you could make this a bridle. Um, I'll show you some examples. Oops, he fell over. <laughs> But an example is this bridle. Yeah, I made it out of ribbon, and it was kind of a last-minute thing. So that's, it, it's not great, but still. Okay. So, um, so, you know, if you did this, all you have to do, if you wanted, is you could put a throat latch. And just make sure when you're measuring the throat latch, um, you measure it enough so it can come off the horse's ears. And then if you just did the side and tied it on, what you'd do next is you'd take a little like loop and you'd measure it over the horse's ears. So I'm gonna make a slip knot really quickly. Yeah, come in. Okay, so I made a slip knot. And it's a slip knot. Okay, um so I'm going to tighten this. Like that. So see how it's loose enough, it's and then you can trim the excess. So it's not too tight and it's not too loose, and it's still hopefully it can come off over the horse's ears and slip down. And then what you'll do is now that you have your um, your brow band, I guess. Not brow band. Um, you have like your throat latch. 
and you have your um, nose piece, nose bit thing, not a bit, but yeah. And then what you do is, I'm going to cut sides really quickly. That's almost even. Okay, and then what you're going to do is you're just on your nose piece. You're just going to tie one of your uh, side pieces on. And I won't do that because it takes me forever. And directly across from where you tied on one piece, you're going to tie on the other piece. And then you'll have something that, well, you know, oops, something that kind of looks like that. And it'll just be, you have your nose piece and then your sides. And then, basically, what you're going to do is you're going to uh, just tie on the other ends, obviously, up to the bra band. And when I said glue is optional, I meant that because... It's optional, you can glue uh, your two pieces of yarn together if you would like. You don't have to though. Okay, and then as I was saying, you can take this design and apply it like a lot of different places. You could make like a halter, you could make a bridle. Here, let me show you actually a bridle that I made kind of using this method. So. Got this. So, like this bridle. It doesn't have a throat latch, but it's got reins. It's kind of a western bridle, kind of in English. And it's made out of rubber bands, so one size fits all. So, there are a lot of different halters that you can make. Um, there's also the briar ones. Check out my video on halters, which. I'll leave it somewhere. It's in... Yeah. Okay, so check that video out. And that was a tutorial on how to make a rope halter. I hope you enjoyed. Please comment, rate, and subscribe. Thanks. Bye.